All right, the 49th annual Cornhill Arts Festival coming up this weekend kicks off 10 a.m. Saturday. This year, taking a renewed focus on music. My guest right now, Michael Woody Woodward, the entertainment producer for the festival. You also brought Jimmy and Todd, mm -hmm. who are going to perform for us in a bit. But you're talking a, a lot of music this year. Yes, 20, uh, 26 performances by 24 different acts, including Jimmy and Todd will perform together. They're going to do a, uh, a duo thing on Saturday afternoon mm -hmm. at uh, Atkinson Street, and then we're going to move them right over to uh, uh, the main stage. And Primetime Funk is going to perform, wow. and Todd is going to sing with them as well. That's going to be great. Um, so where can people find all the information when they want to see a lineup of the shows? Sure. We've got a website, www.cornhillartsfestival.com, mm -hmm. and you can get all the information for the festival there, including, you know, uh, the shuttle services, where to find those, you know, to get into the festival. Mm -hmm. That's going to be challenging sometimes, yeah. along with the music schedule and what we're doing for food and crafts and everything else. Everything is all included there on, yeah. that, on and that website. And it's all for the weather mm -hmm. looks good, so that's a good thing because it's going to be outdoors, a lot of it. And I was just saying, where can people find a lineup? Maybe just hang out there because it seems like there's going to be a lot of great acts. So not only people that they might be familiar with, but some new faces too. And you talked about this renewed focus on music and, and young artists. Right. Why is that important? Well, it's important because we need to support the Rochester community. And, and like these guys were saying earlier, you know, they, music isn't such a prevalent thing in the school systems now. They don't really have the budgets to do that as much. So we like, we like to, to encourage these young artists and give them the opportunity to perform on our stages and try to get them focused on, on, on the possibility that they can succeed in this business if they yeah. want to. And, and we've had artists in the past that have done that for us, too. And you say you play, too, I right? Do. Yeah. I do. And what do you play? I, I do percussion work with a band out of uh, Houston, Texas. CJ wow. Chenier and the Red Hot Louisiana Band. Busy guy. Mm -hmm. All right, we're going to let you guys play. Uh, what are you guys going to play for us? Well, we're going to do a little James Taylor for you. Oh. All right. Well, you got plenty of time, so I'm going to let you have the floor. <laughs> and all maybe right. we'll have time. Take your time, and we'll soak it all in. All right. <laughs> all right. Just to change And as the moon arises It sits by his fire Just thinking by women And glasses of beer Closing his eyes As the doggies retire He sings out a song Which is soft but it's clear Just as if maybe someone could hear colors I choose Won't you let me go down in my dreams Yes, and rock a bye, oh sweet baby James Said goodnight all you moonlight ladies Rock a bye, oh sweet baby James Deep greens and blues are the colors I choose won't you let me go down in my dreams? Yes, and rock a bye, oh sweet baby. Yeah. Oh, that was awesome. I want more. Can you give me more? 
<laughs> we got time, but first we want to remind people where they can see you. It's at the Cornhill Arts Festival. Kicks off at 10 a.m. this Saturday, and they're going to be performing all week. Uh, and, and Mike, which uh, what's the website again? Uh, the website is www.cornhillartsfestival.com, and you can like us on face on Twitter, and you can find us on Facebook as well. Like all us right. on Facebook as well. So we got you covered. We got one minute left. You got something else you for bet. us? All right, let's hear it. <laughs> Some folks like to get away, take a holiday from the neighborhood. Have a flight to Miami Beach or to Hollywood. I'm taking a Greyhound, the Hudson River Line. I'm in a New York state of mind. I've seen all the movie stars, the fancy guards and the limousines. Been high in the Rockies, but down the Evergreens. I knew what I needed. I don't want to waste more time. Mm.